Hello everyone, I'm back with another video for my pastime with my channel here on YouTube. It's going to be a little different today. Um, you guys are used to watching me um, unbox watches from Watch Gang, the subscription service. Well, I got into another subscription service called Bespoke, 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 whatever it is, something like that. So again, it's a monthly subscription. They charge you on a monthly basis, give or take 45 to 50 with shipping and you know, you go through this process of picking different things that you like, different things that you don't like, and then they send you a package based on what you, uh, uh, your preferences. So for me, I'm into liquor, cigars, um, watches, of course, you know, outdoorsy stuff, knives. I like a good knife and things like that. And so they, they went ahead and put together a package for me and I got it. So there's a lot more control, um, with bespoke you can actually go on there, and if you don't like the package they're going to send you, you can kind of pick something else. So that's what I did with this one. The first package they were going to send me, I wasn't really too into. I wasn't really too into. Well, I wasn't into that that much. And so um, without further ado, I'll show you what I did pick. Um, as you can see, I got some rum here with me and a lighter. So I guess you can kind of guess what we're about to do. Let's get into it. It's a pretty big box. I'm actually standing up right now. We'll see how this works. I was pretty excited to get into this one. I, I had been seeing ads, of course, uh, online about this, uh, or actually a few different services. Uh, this one in particular seemed um, kind of cool to me because, like I said, they give you the ability to choose, pick and choose what you're going to get. And this one in particular, I was kind of excited about. doesn't have my information on it. I'm just going to throw that to the side. Oh, sorry about hitting the camera. So we got some uh, hickory wood smoking chips. So if you don't know already, let's pull it out. Oh, euphemism. Let's see what we got. All right, let's see if we got a picture. Nope, no picture. We got this. Using using smoking wood chips. There it is. Cocktail smoking and infusing kit. Now I don't know if rum is exactly the one, the type of uh, alcohol that they're looking for. But I do know what the Bayou Rum tastes like. I'm very, very fond of it. Actually comes from a small place out there in Louisiana, close to Lake Charles. If you're not familiar with that, then uh, it's a pretty cool facility, actually. Um, I would recommend if you're in the area or near there, go check it out. So, of course, we've got the glass here. Um, let's see, we've got the wood block. I'm going to put this stuff off to the side and then we'll get it in front of you guys. Then they gave me a torch lighter. I'm not going to crack this open because I think it'll be too. Uh, it'll be kind of a hard time getting getting uh, stuff into this, making sure it works. So they do give you a lighter, and let's get all this stuff on camera real quick. So they give you the cover, they give you a wood block, and then they give you a lighter. I did bring my trusty lighter so we can kind of go through the process a little quicker, and. We're gonna go ahead and get into it. I'm I'm kind of excited. Like I said, it's one of those deals. Um, I'd seen this before. My actual, my brother-in-law has uh, one similar to this, and we had some cocktails on that not long ago. And I, I kind of liked it. Something about uh, having a different flavor with the kind of drinks you drink usually. So let's get into it. Oh, okay. So they're just right there. So from what I understand, or from what I've seen. You put some chips on here. You know what I didn't bring myself? A cocktail glass. Uh, stand by. I'm gonna be right back. All right, if you can hear me, you can hear me coming back. Camera might shake a little bit. All right, here we go. So we place the cup inside like so. We pour some of the Exo Bayou rum into the glass. I'm not sponsored by these guys or anything like that, so 
just uh first thing i saw and i thought okay let me try this because i know what it's like it tastes pretty good so i can tell the difference hopefully between the smoked glass of it and the what i usually drink so from what i understand oh i guess we should uh To see how that goes so huh maybe the torch lighter isn't the best well actually there's some smoke in there but we'll see let me put it direct okay there we go there we go okay so i don't know if you can see the smoke sort of enveloping the glass but there's definite smoke in there now and we'll let that sit for a second not too long just kind of let it get inside the glass get inside the liquor maybe open it up a little bit i don't know excited uh, last time i did this definitely changed the flavor or at least you know made a com a made, I put a complexity to the liquor let's wow okay so the wood chips definitely you can smell it and I'm not going to be on camera, but I can assure you I'm going to take a drink. Smelling inside the glass, you could definitely smell the, I guess, it smells like barbecue, sort of. Wow. Okay. So, I find the Bayou Rum to be sort of, what's the word for it? You know, if you don't drink straight liquor or, or neat then you kind of get that sort of weird looking face whenever you take a sip of it. But for some reason, when I did that just now, it wasn't as strong forward. I don't know if that has anything to do with the smoke or what, or maybe it's just I've been drinking for so long it doesn't happen anymore. Definitely can smell it inside the glass. Um, as far as the drink itself, I guess, yeah, you know, whatever hits your nose sort of, it tends to hit your... Uh, your taste buds a little bit and I, I can definitely taste uh, the barbecue style type deal on my on my breath and I haven't been, I haven't had any barbecue so awesome okay well you know I'm gonna be doing this a lot more that's for that's for sure um, definitely not at my desk like this sort of hopefully uh, outdoors or somewhere where a fire won't <laughs> cause any serious damage but yeah so that's my first shipment of bespoke posts there's uh, more to come I'm gonna probably do 12 months again um, on this type of uh, deal, see how see what I get, and uh, I'll be opening it with you guys. Uh, like and subscribe. I hope you uh, enjoy the video. Um, if you get a chance, if you're in the area, I recommend buy you rum. This is the XO bottle. They have a different, uh, a few different types. Uh, be I'll be at one that's got coffee, one that's more of an orange, and then I want to say one. Let's see. Off the top of my head, I can't think, but it's it's actually pretty good stuff, man. And uh, this one is my favorite, so. All right, guys, I appreciate you guys stopping by. Hopefully you enjoy the video and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Actually coming up here and before now, probably in about 15 days or so, I'll get my 11th watch for Watch Gang and we'll be taking a look at that. Thanks a lot. Have a good one. Bye.